Okay, guys, this is Kevin again. Um, we've been talking about the, the the noise that's been made by the motor on my little Pratt & Whitney lathe. And some of the guys suggested that I change the uh, switching frequency of the variable frequency drive. And this is the little Hitachi that I run. Uh, I'm not going to pretend to know everything that it's talking about here, but I will tell you, so I don't know if it'll focus in on the book or not, but here's where it starts talking about the carryable frequency. Uh, if you can read it, you can pause it and take a look, but uh, on with the show. What this is set up to do right now, it is set at 3.0, and uh, it's the frequency of it, so we will store that. Give you an example of the sound of the motor. You can hear that high pitch, horrible, horrible bracket. I want to shut that thing off. Um, and to change that, we go in here, bump it up to four, we'll store that, try that speed, and you can hear it's gone up a little bit in frequency, but it's still rather annoying. So we'll stop it, we'll go back into that function, we can raise it up to five, store that, And it's getting a little higher, but still just as annoying. Um, what I've selected was to step it on up, way on out there, and uh, run it to where it's not going to bother me. It might make the neighbor's dog a little uncomfortable, but that's not my problem. Um, here you, you hear that it is completely gone in the really annoying frequency range. It's a little high pitch, but it's something that you can live with. If it gets annoying, I can run it all the way up to 14. Um, I don't know if I'll be in violation of somebody's codes or what, but uh, it's not really going to bother me a whole lot. So there's the quick little video you guys wanted on that stuff. Have fun.